If I was going to make a business, what would I do and want to make a business? Okay. So there are four major questions in life. Just like you have your four major numbers, there's four major questions in life. And the faster you answer these questions, the faster you will achieve your goals, your wants, and your desires. Four major questions. The first one is, who am I? Once you figure that out, and I have an easy way to answer that, it's your name. That's who you are. Your name, right? What does your name mean? I don't know. You got to figure that out, okay? Once you get that question down, then the question poses, well, okay, who am I? Denzel Napoleon Rodriguez, 23 years old, da, 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 right? You put your your work, your history, your experience right after that and things that you do, wants, desires, purpose, okay? Then the question comes, well, why am I here? So why are you here? We are the only species on earth that ask this question. Monkeys know why they're here. Dogs know why they're here. Cats, fish, the birds, all the, the whole animal kingdom they know why they're here, but we can't seem to figure it out, and we're at the top of the food chain. What's up with that? So you got to figure that one out. Why am I here? Best way to answer that is by figuring out what made you. Who made you? How did you get here? Mom, dad, okay, but then who made mom and dad? Who made their mom and dad? Okay, okay, okay. We get some data. We start getting a little medical, uh, meta, metaphysical, right? Is that what it's called? We get a little into the, into the quantum, into the science, into the spiritual, okay? So why am I here? Once you've figured out who am I and why you're here, and the way you answer that question is by figuring out who the manufacturer is. So man, you got to find out who the manufacturer is. Who made you? Because only they have the ability to tell you who you are. How can you possibly tell who you are, right? Or why you're here? You mean you 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 can say it, right? You can you can come up with your own answer. But what if what if you're wrong, right? So we got to figure out who the manufacturer is. Then we start getting into the meat and potatoes. What's my purpose? What's my purpose? Again, you got to go to the manufacturer for that. <clears throat> when Ford made the car, the car knows that it has to do X, Y, and Z, and it's made with these parts. Well, the manufacturer creates a manual, puts it in the car, so when the user gets in, they could read the manual and they can see, oh, that's how you turn the car on. Okay, when there's an ignition problem, when there's a transmission problem, when I need to change the oil, when I need to change tires, there's a manual, 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 right? Manufacturer. Okay, cool. And that will define the purpose of the product. So I'm a product of my maker. Hmm. Got to figure that one out. Once you get that down, you'll have the answer to your question. If I was to make a business, right? What would I do and what would I want to you know, do? Whatever it is. And then the final one is where are you going? Because if you don't know where you're going, right? You could know who you are. You can know why you're here. You can know your purpose and everything. But if you don't have direction for your purpose and why you're here and who you are, I mean... You're, as, you're useless, man. You're like, you're working at a job that just ain't for you. You're in a position that just ain't who you are. You're doing things outside of your comfort zone that don't align with your mission, with your purpose. There are some things that we have to do in life that are uncomfortable, yes. And you have to step out of your comfort zone, yes. But then there are people who get stuck in uncomfortability or they get stuck in comfort which becomes uncomfortable because it's so comfortable and you get confused right and i'm confusing myself right now so where are you going you got to know where you're going to go in life 
to answer that question, right? So I hope that helps, my friend. I'm telling you, these I could give you the stats. I could say, hey, start a business, start a financial business, start a fitness business, start a branding business or a marketing business. These are the hottest businesses right now. But if that does not align with you, then you are going to be terrible at it, right? Or you're gonna be fake, right? You don't wanna be fake, right? Or you're gonna be so good at it, but then not fulfilled with it. You could be good at something, but not really be fulfilled with it. Like I know there are some things that I'm good at that don't fulfill me. And then there are things that I'm great at, that it's like, this is me, man. This is where I'm supposed to be all day, every day. I wake up, this gets me excited. I'm, I have the drive like no other. So not only am I doing what I'm great at, but I love it and it fulfills me, okay? Because our ambitions can kill us, right? Our ambitions to reach so high that you don't know why you went that high in the first place. So you wanna make sure you're on that level.